be a gamble, man, though. I'm going to show you how to quickly and easily create. Once you've claimed your land, it will be impossible for other players to build in your area, steal your stuff, or kill your animals. Basically, your build will be grief-proof. If you have any doubt about the level of protection, look for a link to proof in this video's description. To make your very first land claim, all you have to do is place a chest. You'll get a 9x9 land claim centered at that chest. You'll also see some gold and glowstone blocks appear, which are there to show you the boundaries of your land claim. Those blocks are inside your land claim, so you can safely build right on top of them. Just to be clear, those special blocks aren't actually there, and other players don't see them. They just appear on your screen to help you visualize the boundaries of your land claim. To make them go away, get out a stick and right click outside of your land claim. To bring them back, right click inside your land claim. They'll also come back automatically if you accidentally stray outside of the boundaries while building. You can have more land claims and bigger land claims later, but you only get one of these automatic chest based land claims. If you want to move it, use the Abandon Claim command to delete your land claim, then place a new chest to get a new land claim. Land claims go all the way to the max build height and also sink a few blocks into the ground. As you dig or build underneath your land claim, it will automatically extend downward to claim the new area you've just explored. To allow another player to build with you, use the Trust command. If you change your mind, use Untrust. You can also give players permission to access your stuff, but not build, using the Container Trust command, which includes permission to kill animals. To keep other players out of your home, use an iron door with a button, and make sure that button is inside your land claim. Don't use a pressure plate, because anyone can activate a pressure plate, including monsters. To allow a player access to your home, but not to your belongings, use Access Trust. If you forget who you've given permission to, use Trust List. Eventually, you'll want to make your land claim bigger and possibly create additional land claims. Golden Shovel. You can go mining or trade another player for some gold. To resize, you can move a land claim corner by first right clicking it with your golden shovel, then right clicking again in the new location for that corner. Similarly, you can an additional land claim by first right clicking at one corner of the new claim area, then pointing at the opposite corner and right clicking again. You may discover that you don't have enough claim blocks to claim the additional area you're interested in. On most servers, you'll get 100 claim blocks for every hour you play on the server, but standing around and idling or chatting won't earn you blocks. If you don't have enough blocks to claim the area you want, it's probably best just to go adventuring for a while and check again later. On some servers, it might be possible to get claim blocks by voting for the server, donating to the server fund, or participating in special events, so just ask around. Finally, if you can't remember where you put a land claim, use claims list to get a coordinates as well as the total claim blocks you spend on each of your land claims. It's also possible to create a player town where you're the mayor and you create a in this video's description. Your build will be on the screen to help so you can safely build right on top of your land claim. Those your first land claim, all you have to do is place a chest. You'll get a
panels?
Just pull me away, pull 